Hey everybody, this is Toge, I'm Junkie, and I want to welcome you all back to my channel. Now, when we last left off, we watched sweet, sweet Geeky Warren beat the crap out of Nathan Dipshit. Oh man, it was so great. Like, one of the highlights of this walkthrough, especially with the remaster and how they made his face even more bloodied and bruised. It was so awesome. Now, now we're going to go pay Fa Frank a visit, and... Uncover the location of the dark room. After we get his um, list of people. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. And if I can, if I play this right, then we won't even need to use the rewind. Forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah, you, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Uh, well, actually, we're going to have to dick around because I need to get that photo of the whales. But after that, no more dicking around. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot to pl plug in my charger as well. Um, do that now while I take this photo. Those whales look so awful, but still so majestic. Uh, how do I take a photo? There we go. There we go. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. Let's do this. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I give the money. We still got some more left over anyway, so. Oh, I thank you. Just give him what he's owed. So hard now, was it? And let's not do any more business again. Now, if you excuse me. Frank, could we ask you a couple quick questions? You have some serious lady balls. No. Jesus. Okay. Okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I, I... Oh, Christ, I hate you. Damn, I stuffed it up. You expect everything for free. 
You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. What, you, you come in peace? After you aimed a fucking gun at me, and then pulled the trigger! Uh, to be honest, hmm. Frank, you scared me. You held a knife on my friend. I didn't want to pull the trigger. I could tell by the way you held that pop gun, with both hands like it was a magnum. Or maybe I shouldn't have brought that knife to a gunfight. I only want to shoot with my camera. I swear. Ask Chloe. Look, Frank, Max doesn't need a gun anyway. So are we cool? Please? Okay. We're cool for now. But my dog is And if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? Of course I do. I heard you even rescued a bunch of fight dogs. That's amazing. No, all right, it was just the right thing to do. I couldn't stand to see those poor animals treated like, like slaves. That's how I came to own Pompidou. That's very cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now? Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now. Especially from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? You have Rachel's bracelet. You obviously know more than you're telling. So tell us. Never come into my home and tell me what to do. Understand? Man, there is something about you that is so wrong. I don't trust you at all. Now get out of my face. We don't have much time, Frank. Rachel needs you. It's too late! She's gone! You don't even know her! Like you did? I loved her, asshole! And she loved me. I know that. Chloe, you don't know shit! You were part of her problem! Always trying to take her away from me! Always! Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do! Get it, bitch! Damn it. Get it! Set the fuck back now! Damn it. You fucking killed my dog. Oh my god. Ah, damn, I stuffed that up. I just shot a man and his dog. I killed Frank Powers. You saved my life, Chloe. It, it was self-defense for both of us. Max? Frank is really dead. I know, but we can't stop now. We have to find that code. Fast. Before the co cops come. That's it. Let's get out of here. Sorry, Frank. I'm sorry. Jesus. All right, we got. Chloe actually killed Frank. She'll never forgive herself or forget this. And uh. only I can change it. I don't understand why, um, Max didn't, it doesn't give you the option to like, for Max to take the code, then rewind so she has it on her person, and then we can talk to Chloe here, and say Listen, we got the code, let's go. I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So, 
Tell me exactly what I need to do here. Please watch your mouth. You have no social skills here, and you will piss off Frank immediately. You kind of love this, don't you? Fine, I'll try being like you for a change. Or how you used to be. What's that supposed to mean? Wait, is that a compliment or... Uh, I don't know. I give money. Thanks for hearing me out, Frank. Uh, what? We only want to talk, and it's not even about you. We're not here to start a fight. No, that shit would be over pretty fast. Don't fuck with me, and I won't return the favor. So what do you want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Listen, Frank. I'm sorry. I don't try. I'm sorry. Nuisance, but this is important. Yeah, yeah. Everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah. Well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank. This isn't about me now. Yeah, right. Okay. Both of you are. Mm. We're cool for now, but my dog is, and if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to... Of course... No. That's... Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close. Frank, you knew Rachel almost better than anybody. And you know more than us. Together we could find her. Do you have anything to lose? When Rachel vanished, I pretty much lost everything. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. Please. We really need your client list. Well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. Yeah, I'll take it. My dog isn't barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Frank. Seriously. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. That was cool Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. All right, we did it. Now time to play detective. Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. Better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Oh, a message from Frank. Hi, Max. Just wanted to see how the search was going. Thanks, Frank. We're getting close. I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by later if you both want the party, and good luck. How, how does he have Max's number? It's just like how Chloe had Warren's number. How does Frank get Max's number? Does he get it? Do you get it from Nathan Prescott or something? Everything we need. Now it's time to focus on the big board. Hey Max, see if you can put together all those Rubik's clues. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything.
gather info on the character by selecting all the correct clues for each section. There is a specific number of clues Let's to look at select. Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Frank's account book. Uh, the client names are encrypted. So, uh, what happened to Rachel after this? She brought my standard. Uh, it's not that back. one. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. One. Yes, the game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Next, Tell us everything. All these pieces together. Roger that. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Okay, Max. Remember these names and see how Nathan fits in with all this. Alright, so Nathan is rot, so just Everybody in Arcadia look for all the ones with rot in it. That explains a lot. The Labrador. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. There we go. Select. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. Select. I'm getting a contact high just reading this. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Oh yes. Why am I even looking at These this one for Rod? It's the last one. This is for Frank and Nathan's uh. deals. Uh, that's it, Max. Hey Max, see if you can put together all those Rubik's clues. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Uh. I hope in this case that David has good tracking skills. Uh, that's twin. Does David know what's uh, going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. At least David was finally going after the right suspect. Hmm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate in his own messed up way. Uh, no, I don't. I don't think any of them was. Okay, one, two. Um. Damn. I I must have missed something. Alright, so that's like Twin Peaks. Ah, shit. Um, I'm pretty sure it's one, two. Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. And that's all she wrote. Uh, <sighs> Aha, uh -huh, there we go. Clues about Nathan in here. Great. 
Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating, as usual. He's got the busted... Hmm. He's got the Who busted tail light. Alright, so... One... Two... And that's... What is it? S... S, X, F. Who else was David tracking here? Nope. Yeah, yeah that's the one. Oh, yes. Now we're finally getting somewhere. Chloe. Let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? Holy shit. Uh, so. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Those clues are not related. Uh, so it's good to see the Prescotts can't cover up all their tracks. Uh, we regret to inform you that Nathan has disrupted various classes over the past month despite repeated warnings and leniency due to, due to a crude outburst in Mrs. Hoyder's intro to lecture class on Tuesday, September 20th. Nathan was sent back to his dormitory for the day without a proper write-up for his files. Nathan has enormous potential but also erratic behavior patterns that may need supervision beyond Blackwell's ability. The school cannot tolerate these disruptions, so we hope you will discuss this matter with Nathan to impress upon him the severity of this situation. Please see the attached file for full report. There's a lot of numbers in here. Fine, GPA. That's bullshit. Uh, wait, what's his middle name? Joshua. Or Josh Ua. Okay, Dancing Max. Prick. Let's blow this right, there we go. And go home. Alright, Ian. Fess. Oh, there's Nathan. Speaking for devil. Get ready to fucking die, bitches. You fuck up my dorm room, I kill your schoolership. Alright. So, look at this. Park is eight seven eight nine seven eight nine. Well, it's obviously not one 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 one. Oops, bad code. How do I do this? There we go. It's not this one. <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Uh, that's the code to the dark room, 542. Nine, five, three, three. Oops, code. It's not that. Let me try Five four three one five four three. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Not five four three one four four three six four four. You locked three. it, dumbass. That's 
I want to try and figure out what this code is first, so let's rewind a bunch of times. Zero zero five eight. Zero zero Bad five. Nine nine eight eight. Is that Rachel Eels right in there? Certainly wouldn't be his birthday, would it? One nine. You locked it, dumbass. Ah, fuck it. Let's just go for the puck. Eight seven eight nine seven eight zero oh, eight. Eight seven eight nine seven oh, eight. Yeah. Let's find out what Nathan Prescott oh, is trying to hide. Oh. What's up, Need for G? Okay, cool. Bitch, you sold me water, asshole. Calm down, bring it to me. Bringing yes. it. Stay away, pigs on the beach. This is all about Nathan trying you to. You home? Got the party tonight. Club party. Oh, home. On the way. Load the, the bowl. The Load the bowl. He didn't have enough drugs. Hey, I need to score ASAP. I don't make house calls. You have a car. No, no time. Charge me double. Damn right. Have the cash on you. No fucking around. Give me the address. I'll call you. I'll, I'll, I'll call to give you drugs the exact directions. Drama. In transit. Get the money out. You up, bro? No shit. What do you need? Peruvian flake skiddo acid. You're paying night prices. Don't make me wait. Sorry for being a dick. Need more stuff. You home? Yes. God, Don't man. come. Fuck off. You're out of control. Hey, need weed, etc. Now, calm yourself. You're tweaking? Soon. Hook a brother up, please. So it was Meet you. Beach. Be cool this time. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Yeah, right. Keep your smart mouth shut about no, everything or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. Out. Asshole. Hey whore, Fema Nazis will be exterminated. Father. Watch out. That's brutal. Please do not contact me at work. I've told you this before and being high is not an excuse anymore. This is a business, not just a hobby. You want me to treat you like an adult who can get things done on his own? Impress me. I'd like nothing more than to be proud of you. I'm not there yet. Take a breath, Max. Alright, let's do this. Go through all this data and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Alright, so it's a Prescott no doubt that Nathan's barn, so... So, he could be hiding clues there too. Not much out there. There we go, select the barn. I believe it was the 9th of the 30th. That's 10th of the 7th. 10th of the 7th. Tenth of the 4th. 10th of the 4th. Yeah. Okay, this is just sad, Max. Uh, I know there's a 30th date involved. Uh, 
least I hope I'm right, I hope I'm not wrong. Ten for the seventh. Unless it's where is it? Beach Black Well ten for the four. If I can match one of the text messages and transactions with Frank, then I can find the exact location. Uh so do you select that? <sighs> no. Was this the fourth this one? It's not working. No, that was the seventh. This is yeah. goddamn math. I suck. Might be. Since Kate left the party early with Nathan, I should search for texts, locations, and transactions in the evening. Hold on. In the evening, so 9th of the 30th, 10th of the 3rd. That one's 10th of the 4th. So, this infamous party was the fourth. Alright, so yeah, it was the fourth, so... Are there any more dates about the fourth? Seventh. Seventh. Yeah, I knew it was the fourth. This there we go. This is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Just some shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. I'm shocked. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody, except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. And now for the next photo of the owl. Here I come, collectible. Here, let's go find the best way in. Whoa, check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Dude, somebody was just here. 
Then we need to get in that barn. Alright, so is there any other ones I need to get? So that one. And that one. Where are you, creepy windmill? Oh. I didn't realize that beating a chin out of somebody would bruise my fist. I should really write to these finish before I start reading. Of course I bruised his face worse. He had that coming. The whole fight was so insane. Yes it was. How are you doing? Amped up. I wouldn't want to do it again unless I had to. You paid your hero dues. Now we just need costumes. Speaking of, I hope you're coming to the party tonight so we can s celebrate. I'll let you know, I promise. Cool. Now I have to get back to striking super poses. Alright, speaking of striking, I need to strike this with my camera. Now I need to find a way into the barn. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's... Oh, I've got a bunch of messages here, but I'll look at them later as you get a picture of this goddamn windmill. Aha! Uh -huh. There we go. Alright, now let me take a look at these messages. Alright, so excellent is sweet, I'll be ready, excellent. I'm sure I read that one. And you got Courtney. Yeah, I read all these. Juliet, no Discord. Why are these only popping up again? I don't. No. Uh, but. I found the front door. Come on. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. God, this is way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. Come on, Supermax. Hey, check out this old chest. A little louder, Chloe. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No, no, look closer. Harry Aaron Prescott and family donate new library to Arcadia Bay. Prescott Industries celebrate grand opening. The Prescotts bring bomb shelter boom to town. Nice scrapbook. You search for more clues and I'll scope out the area. All right, let's Chloe would make do a great this. detective too. Should be around. Let's go about the perimeter, Max. Uh, where are you? Just rotting wood. Now you're around here. 
Should be around... <sighs> Nothing here. Supermax, you can't open this with your bare hands. Old. Okay, Chloe, let me know the second. I have to get through this monster padlock first. Can Chloe shoot it with a gun? She has the gun, so shouldn't, shouldn't she be able to shoot it? Alright, so hook. Chloe, can you give me a hand? Sidekick at your service. Hop, hop, and away, Supermax. I dig having minions. Ah, shit, no. Sorry about this, Chloe. Okay. Ah, oh, shit, I was pressing Q instead of W. Oh, no, you don't. Not again. Just uh Alright, so I'm gonna pull this. Then climb. Where is this L? L, 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 where are you? There you are. He's not happy. to say how weird this is he just did who built this kind of place a press god of course <laughs> this bunker is so surreal Five, four. I thought that only worked in the movies. Uh, 
open sesame. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. Now what the hell is this? Here we go. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Okay, a binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. Why the hell would she have a shit one Victoria? Kate wasn't the first. She ain't All pure, she a hoe. With other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. This can't be real. These are all these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe. Maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. Oh my god. Rachel. Kate. Oh, fuck, I can't watch this. Holy, slow down! Wait for me! I know exactly where I'm going! This is it. This is it. Are you gonna help me, Max? Chloe, stop. Look. Please, no. Oh. Oh. That smell. Rachel. Oh. I gotta say, like, I don't, I know this scene is shocking, but I just want to point out the detail on Max and Chloe's fingers with the dirt, because I do not remember that being in the first Life is Strange. I'm going to have to go back and take a look at this, but if they've just, if the remaster just added that, then yeah, that's a pretty good detail. Attention to detail. Because, you know, like, that's what I like in games, it's the minor things, the minor details, the most obscure ones that I enjoy the most because you think it doesn't need to be there but it, I'm glad it's there oh, where's the dough? where's Rachel's spirit? there you are Where? yes we found your body, are you happy now? you can rest now there you go. Because I'm pretty sure one of the developers said it was the deer is Rachel's spirit. I'm pretty sure. Nathan enjoys his last party. 
Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is gonna get in my way. Especially with your help. Right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. Let's do this. Oh, shit. This is like that eclipse. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be too Jesus, moved. Chloe, look up at the sky. Possible. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not... Because I always found that weird, um, okay, so in Life is Strange 2, they all talk about how the storm destroyed Arcadia Bay, yet, I, if you're seeing two moons in the sky, isn't that, like, more what the fuck than an actual storm destroying a city? You know what I mean? Because they talk about, because I'm pretty sure they also mentioned beached whales in, like, a newspaper or something about, about it in Life is Strange 2, but I've never really seen anyone talk about the two moons. You know what I mean? Like, they mentioned the eclipse in in this, in the next episode, I'm pretty sure, Listen, but I just, I just find that a bit odd. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you alright after today? I really flipped out on Nathan. I just hate bullies. And Max, he's dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude, have you been drinking? <laughs> well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so... I want to have something... for prosperity. Well... I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm a pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh... Action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra-violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. Should have canceled the party. Guess I'm not cool enough. Yes, you are, Stella. 
You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck. Alright, let's do this. Let's get these two photos. Pretty sure it's just two. Let me double check. One and two. I missed out on that one because it was somewhere at Coley's house. Can't remember where that, that one with the feet is. And there's a Lissa over there. Don't worry, I'll save you again. Let's do some talking first. I only came to the party because of you. I'm glad to see you out and about. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott tonight? No, I've been hanging with Brooke since I got here. Max, are you okay? Your face looks so serious. Uh, I know. I'm I'm not in party mode tonight. You look like you're on a secret mission. This is where it's going to end. For Rachel's sake. Well, if you want to hang out with Brooke and me, we're here for you. Thanks, Daniel. I have to stay on my mission now. I hope you stay on yours and become a great artist. Well, I'll be celebrating someday in a museum next. Adios. Hello, Brooke. Max, I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you... No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub and his club. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the vortex. Then I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? No, but we're going to map out our drive-in date later. I was just talking to Daniel about a road trip next week to the Portland Art Museum. Oh, that is so cool. He needs a friend. I bet Daniel will be a great museum guy. I'm more into science than art, but what kind of a selfish fangirl would miss a Miyazaki exhibition? You're not selfish, Brooke. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you can fly. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier? Max, if I saw a double moon out there, I would assume it really was the end of the world. Well, the night is still young, Brooke. And so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. No one seems to know where Nathan is. Is he hiding or something? I uh, so can't talk to Courtney yet until I can't get into the Vortex Club. Oh. Ah, shit! Use one moment of poetry right here. A 
okay, but this is like poet karaoke, so don't cringe. I shall be telling this with a sigh. Somewhere, ages and ages hence, two roads diverged in a wood, and I, I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference. That was beautiful, Alyssa. It was exactly what I needed to hear. Thanks for not cringing, and thanks for watching my back. Blackwell would be so much cooler if we all did that for everybody else. But you're a great start, Max. Yes, I I'm back. All right, can I still speak or? I was ready to talk. Didn't think you'd come back. I'm surprised that Blackwell is having a party after Kate almost jumped off a roof. I guess people are happy that Kate is okay now and they can party again. I'm just happy she's drawing again. She seems much better, and her mother is being so supportive for a change. Kate deserves that. Kate deserves revenge. We have to make sure this doesn't happen to anybody else at Blackwell. I can tell you know some serious shit about your face. You don't have to tell me now, but please let me know if I can help, like you helped me. Look at this. I'm at my first and only Vortex Club party. I know. This week was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of people trying to have the time. Even if I hate most of them. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. Or Kate. She must know I punch her in the face. I probably should just for Vortex Club posterity. Alyssa. I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, but it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Good luck. All right, better go back here and fix up these conversations. Space, 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 space. Space, space, space. There we go. Move, Fanny. Damn. There we go. Alright, where is the? Oh, uh, here we go. I was like, where's the restroom? Hey, Max. What are you doing in here? Oh, in that shit. If I get sick now, uh, I can drink more later. I'm not in the mood, but there we go. still, this could be an interesting shot. I'm never leaving this toilet. Now it's the moon shot. This is my last Vortex Club party. Oh no, not again. Hello, can you please hurry? Gross. How did this even get here? You've been vomiting for like an hour. Yo, Maximum Overdrive, about time you got here to save this lame rave. Wanna get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. Just not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Rachel Amber won't be coming either. Damn, I was thinking about Rachel and Chloe tonight. If they showed up together right now, shit would end. Rachel could always shut Victoria down. Good for Rachel. I wish I could have seen that. Max, 
I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus. You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to get my board and grind. The only no, seriously, I'm out of here. Oh, mm. everything isn't so uh. fuzzy. Oh, there's a guy. He's not in the vortex club. Trust me, dude. You're Sucks not to be you. Anything. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay. Sorry, but I'm on the list. Okay. The head I know that Max okay. Caulfield is not on any list for the vortex club. Nice try. Listen. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. I will go straight to Courtney because I'm on the vortex list. Hey Courtney, how are you? Max, our guest star arrives fashionably late. <laughs> Say bonsoir to the end of the world. Even though you flaked on my party makeover, you still get special access to the Vortex Club VIP lounge. You better let your minion know since she won't let me pass. Oh, that little asshole just made her last mistake. She thinks she's Victoria. <laughs> bye bye. Now, let's go make an official VIP entrance, Max Factor. <laughs> Get it? Hey, Sarah. Um, do you know that I personally put Max's name on the list? So, you like decide to block her from coming in while I'm taking a break? <laughs> You're not in charge here. Wait, I, I just... Uh, oh my god, you're done! And you're off the list permanently. Welcome to the Vortex Club. Booyah! And another one bites the dust. Yeah, you can, you can go be sad with this guy. You can go cry in the corner. Alright, here we go. Nathan is the Vortex Club, so his ass has to be here tonight. Oh, a message from Kate. Thank you so much for coming by, Max. You lifted my heart. Kate, I was so happy to see your smile again. You mean so much to me and to so many others. I have to go, but tell Warren thanks. He's so sweet. He brought me... He brought me here. He bought. He brought by some school books I needed. Give him a hug for me. I'll certainly give him your thanks. Call me as soon as you can. She's wasted. Oh, she's Nobody not the fuck out. Nobody learns at Blackwell. What's up, Hayden? Oh, look. Up in the sky, it's Super Max here to save the party. Have you seen Nathan? I just vaped some dank OG butts, so I can barely see you. Or are these hotties next to me? You want a hit? No. I want to find Nathan. Me too! He's supposed to be bringing some special party favors. I hope that the party you actually planned a party at the party. Not this week. So, has anybody here seen Nathan? I guess you have to go ask everybody here. Or, you could sit down and take a quick hit. Hayden, does Sean Prescott pay for the Vortex Club parties? What doesn't he pay for? Prescott's shit money. How else could we afford DJ Doomsday to spin? The Prescott family is literally making you dance. Whatever. I'm in this world to have fun. Try it sometime, Max. I finally get you and Dana to come out to a Vortex Club party, but you just want to lecture me? Gee, thanks, Mr. Madsen. 
How much fun did Kate have at your last party? Listen, Amy. Just watch out for Nathan tonight. I think that's your job, Max. Come back when you're ready to have fun. Oh my god. Max, seriously? What are you doing here? Taylor, have you seen Nathan yet? If I did, it's none of your business. This is a VIP area, so you should get back to the beaches. Eat shit, Taylor. Enjoy the end Eat of the world. Shit. Okay, like, maybe I will. Where do I take that picture? So like... Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Logan, Victoria. Should I warn her? Oh, oh shit, no! Uh, did you hear something? I'm trying. God damn it. Eat shit. Enjoy. Damn right. Alright, where the hell? I know I, got, I know that photo. I've got to take a picture of the moon here. Unless, uh, unless I missed it. Fuck. Oh well, I'll get, I'll get it next time. Victoria, she always knows where he is. Don't you ever want to see Max? You're so cute. We never will talk. Talk about what? The next Bigfoots game. We could go out to the field. I can show you some moves. Touchdown. Logan, don't me hurt. Oh my god. That was way more exciting than the band. Catch you later, Max. I don't say I don't even remember that him saying that to her. It's been so long since I've played the game. Or maybe I've never heard this is my first time. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Such cringe. Go fuck yourself, Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. You still pissed about me taking your picture? Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh tried to kill herself in front of you. And me. Everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. 
Oh, oh I will. You didn't help Kate at that party. You knew she was totally wasted. Then you sent the video to everybody just to twist the knife. Wow. Are you kidding me? I didn't make her drink that wine. Nobody pushed her tongue into everybody's mouth. I watched her, Max. Then shame on you. And you know Kate was dosed, no matter how much you deny it. That's why she ended up on that roof. And you made sure to take one last video of her, right? I deleted that video from my phone, Max. Oh, I bet that comforts Kate's family. I don't even know how you sleep at night. I'm not perfect, okay? I'm a teenager at an art school. I'm only here to become a photographer and get famous. Your photographs suck, Victoria. You make fun of my selfies, but most of your photos are basically headshots. I don't think Richard Avedon has anything to worry about. Oh, you did not just say that. I can't wait to see you choke when Mr. Jefferson selects my incredible photo for the Everyday Heroes contest. Uh, yeah, I saw you try to blackmail Mr. Jefferson last night because you're so incredible. That was so pathetic, Victoria. Uh, no, Creeper. We were talking about the contest. You didn't even enter a picture, so stop acting like Oh, shit, I was there. Uh... Mr. Jefferson gives a shit about you either. I mean, have you ever even watched his body language when you try to cuddle up to him? <sighs> Sad. Ha! Ha! By the way, nobody says we have to be friends, Max. Good. I have real friends. I wouldn't want to fake them. You tried to act like all shy and humble. You took a picture of me covered in paint. Who do you think set up the paint can to fall? It wasn't Sam, you dumbass. And you trashed my room after, so stop lying. You did that? You bitch. You could have killed me with that fucking can. I almost got that freak Samuel fired. And that would have been bad. You're right, Victoria, for once. You actually think you're better than me. No fucking way. Guess I'll never be a member of the Vortex Club. No, bitch. You won't. Never mind. It was good talking to you. Yeah, she won't believe me even if I want her. Eat a dick, Max. You're just jealous of me because I actually do the things you can't. I put my photographs out there while you hide behind your lame retro self. At least tell me what makes them do. Uh, why do you want to know? Principal Wells wanted to see us money. It's no big deal. Then why ask me? I haven't even seen him tonight. Adios. Au revoir. I have warned Victoria about Chloe, Nathan isn't here. No. She wouldn't have listened to anyone. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So he made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. Are you both okay? You look like you're on a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later. Well, like the beating he got from Warren. Of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but yeah, I bet you, you do. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost on. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Oh, I can't watch this. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, but I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. 
the envelope, please. And the winner is... Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Mr. Jefferson, it was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. She is the real everyday hero of Blackwell, and I can't wait for her to come back. I can't listen to this thank bullshit. You. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. What? How does nobody question that? Now there's one moon. Just get well now there's two kind of because of the puddle. Jokes. Seven minutes. No, it's gone. It's just one now. Light over so there. Creepy out here. Oh, is that the? That's the lighthouse. Oh, I okay. hate this place. What is? Oh, Chloe! Don't you fucking leave me! Where have you gone? Max, please, oh fuck, Jefferson! It's fucking. Ah. Uh. Where are you? I was like, oh shit, Jefferson's picking us off one at a time. Come on, come on. Here we go. Nathan needs to die now. Look, we can't track Nathan if you're not going to be cool. Max, when we catch Nathan, you better be one so I can kill him over and over. Oh, God's sake, Chloe, you have to be quiet. Max, we could die, hurry. okay? Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh no.
Yeah, I still can't lie. I remember when when this like episode came out. This was such a big thing on YouTube when I was on there. Well, I wasn't on YouTube at the time. This was 2015. But I mean, when I was looking on YouTube, and a lot of people were just like, "Oh shit, how could this happen?" Some people were like, "Yeah, I called it," because there was a Fury video after episode three, I think it was, and people saying, "Oh yeah, Jefferson's like the Jefferson's." Or might have been after episode two, actually. Yeah, and Jefferson's. No, no, no. It was after episode three because they mentioned the dark room in episode three, and so people were theorizing what Jefferson said in episode two about framing a student in a dark room. So, like, oh yeah, he might be able to do it. So you accepted Chloe's request, seventy-two percent. You let Warren beat up Nathan, forty-five percent. No one got hurt, eighty percent. Well, I got the 5% first, but then I went back, got 80%. You didn't warn Victoria. She she wouldn't have believed me anyway. And and the irony of the situation is, if you do be nice to her and you warn her, then she gets abducted in the dark room and... Yeah, she's gone. But she's... I'm pretty sure she's still going to end up there. She still ends up there anyway. If you read through... um, I've made theory videos about this, but... Um, that scene where in episode 5 when you see Jefferson's like got a photo, it's one of the pictures when you when you've changed your timeline how the photos change and there's David with two officers and Jefferson's there with photos and it's during that time he's actually taking photos of Victoria which she which is mentioned in a letter you can find that she sends to David in episode 5 in the Destroy Arcadia Bay in, in the Sacrifice Arcadia Bay ending, I believe. Alright, so 45% saved the blue tray, 92% didn't stir the bird's nest. Yeah, that's why I need to take a photo of it. Found David's code, 52%. I didn't find it, I, I knew it off my heart. Oh, yep, 70%. Kate helped find Nathan's room. You motivated Daniel to attend the Vortex party. You didn't leave a message on Warren's slate, I didn't want to give him the wrong message there. You didn't figure out Nathan's pin code? No, I did not. 78% helped Alyssa. Is that it? Alright, so that's the end of this video. And I like how it's like, they even got here, episode <laughs> episode 5. It's like, um, this is if you like sacrifice Arcadia Bay to save Chloe. They've even just got this, that ending. It's like, yep, this is what you're going to choose. <laughs> Uh, so anyways, that's the end of this video. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one. This is Tokyo Majora.